All right, so a bunch of dudes are posting about Timberly and the old course back in the mid 90s, early 2000s, and uh, I knew I had some gems out there somewhere. So here's some seven and four clips from 2000. Uh, Northern Waters kick off almost 18 years ago. Crazy. Now from golf to golf with frisbees or discs, if you prefer. Sunday at Timberley, it's the Northern Waters Disc Golf Series season opener. The MWDG series is for players of all abilities and sizes, and fun should be had by all. So we're hoping to get a bunch of new people out, we're hoping to get a bunch of people of intermediates out, uh, a bunch of advanced players out as well. Um, we're shooting for around 100 people probably, and... Uh, it's going to be a great time. Weather is telling me it's going to be a little chilly, maybe, but that should be all right. <laughs> hey, the tight. Oh, yeah. So we got another clip here coming just up. So uh, hold tight for just a quick moment here, and uh, they jump into another one. Good stuff. <laughs> Love it. Okay, there were an awful lot of disappointed golfers out there this weekend, maybe hoping to get out and hit the links, but instead, of course, woke up with a little bit of snow. But not everyone had to do without their golf fix this weekend. Frisbee golf took center stage at Kimberly Resort in Leelanau County. Now the game is played like regular golf, but instead of hitting a ball, you use a flying disc toward the cage, which serves as the hole. Today's event kicks off a summer-long series of tournaments. And if you'd like to learn more about frisbee golf, you can give them a call at 231-348-0847. And it looks like lots of fun. Well, that's just... You are right, Mr. Marshallette. It is absolutely uh, super duper fun. All right, so one last little clip here. Oh. I think they've cornered the market when it comes to golf, but a Northern Michigan group of guys begs to differ. You see, that's golf with a ball in Augusta. Real golfers play with a disc. Here's John Richards. When you think of golf, you think of beautiful landscapes, par threes, good times, and discs. Well, this group does. In fact, when they talk about the other sport, they refer to it as ball golf. And we don't want to say yeah. regular golf because that implies that disc golf is not normal. Right. So we try to stick with ball golf and disc golf. Ball golf? Um, I, I have. I'm not very good at it. Uh, I, I spend the vast majority of the time playing disc golf. The popularity of disc golf continues to rise. It's kind of like a combination of hiking and basketball with the rule and etiquette of ball golf. It's growing like mad. Uh, we first put this course in here in 96, and it was just some poles and posts and a handful of guys. And uh, now, you know, four years later, we got a bunch of tournaments up here, league play going on. Uh, getting out and just watching the discs fly. No, no competition at all. Everybody's there just to have the good time. We don't talk about my scores. <laughs> no caddies, no niggers, and very inexpensive to play. Believe it or not, a professional disc golfer can earn up to $25,000 in a single summer. So practice up because it's a lot harder than it looks. From Kimberly, I'm John Richard, 74 Sports. And there's a big disc golf tournament at Timberlay on Sunday. You can still enter, so make your way down to Timberlay and have fun this weekend. Mm -hmm. You can you can play. I think I'll watch. Oh. As usual. Okay. <laughs> so, yes. I like the dress code. Though. Yeah, very good. Huh? All right. Some high-quality entertainment, old school. All right. Cheers, all.